Wheaties is remembering the legacy of one of their own by giving back to its customers. The store will sell single dip cones for a dollar, and it's in honor of one of the store's founders who once said, you'll never see a sad person with an ice cream cone. Local 4's Josh Vinton doesn't look sad at all. He joins us live from Whitey's with more on the history behind it. Josh, good morning to you. Hi, good morning, Redrick. No, there's no frown on my face. I'm smiling like a kid in a candy store. I'm Josh Vincent in an ice cream shop. And we're here at Whitey's in Moline because they're going to have a big sale tomorrow in honor of Bob Thunberg, who would have been 100 years old. And I'm joined by his granddaughter today. Good morning, Annika. How's it going? Good morning. Well, how are you? Pretty good. Pretty good. So tell us about this promotion tomorrow. Everybody is pretty excited. <laughs> we are pretty excited. So tomorrow for the whole day at all of our locations, we're having a dollar cone sale for Bob's 100th birthday. So if you come into any of our stores, you can get a single dip for a dollar, which is a great deal. And we're really excited to be able to celebrate. That's pretty awesome. So even though it's cool, well, actually it's cold outside. <laughs> what are some of the good holiday flavors that some people are saying, hey, you know what? That's why I want to try out this time of year. Yeah, well, actually some exciting news. Red Velvet is coming back today, which is a fan favorite. Okay. So people will be pretty excited about that one. Um, other fall flavors that are out. We have our peppermint Oreo that's out, German chocolate cake, mm -hmm. um, carrot cake still available in some stores. So there's always something fun to try. And right now we um, actually are having a deal in our Sergeant Camo as well because mm -hmm. we're celebrating 10 years of the flavor and all of the profits go to military veterans groups. And since the time of its inception in 2009, we've donated over $100,000 for military veterans groups. So a lot of fun things happening. <laughs> wow, that's awesome. And it's right in time for Veterans Day coming up on exactly, Monday, right? Exactly, exactly. Yeah. It was good timing. So we figured it was a good month to celebrate. So you said all we have to do tomorrow is just come in, have a buck in our hand and... <laughs> exactly. And whichever flavor you'd like. So um, it'll be a fun day. Lot, lots happening at the stores, but it's a great way to celebrate and remember the legacy that Bob left behind. That is awesome. That is awesome. Thank you, Annika. And yeah, as I mentioned, guys, yeah, come on down tomorrow here at this Whitey's or any Whitey's across the Quad Cities area. Only, you, only thing you need is just a dollar and you can get you a single dip of ice cream on the cone. That's going to be awesome. Coming up in our uh, next half hour, we're going to talk more about the legacy of Bob. And then also we're going to try some ice cream. And I'm definitely looking forward to that. But as for now, reporting live here in Moline, Illinois, Josh Vincent, local for news. I'm Reggie. sure you are looking forward to that, Josh. Thanks. That'll be on Fox 18, by the way. All right. Well,